Steve. I've done some ink and nail jobs and we are masses ahead of the competition in terms of how long it's lasting. Stainless steel, I did a trial against stainless steel, went from 474 parts with another manufacturer's product to over 2000 with us on some 316 stainless steel on one inset. So massive gain. In today's Technical Corner, we're joined by Vargas. So you may think we're going to talk about threaded, but we're not. We're going to talk about a product you may not know Vargas for, but they get an increase in market share here in the UK, in fact, the globe. Daniel, welcome to the studio. Hi, Joe. Small part machining. Yep. Tell us more. Yeah, so this is our microscope range for small part machining, as you just alluded to. Um, it is a, a massive, massive part of my portfolio, especially down in the south of England, where I've grown it over the past few years. It's actually increased over 100% in the last two years alone. Um, we've been winning some big, big, big trials and conversions against some of the other big players in the game that everybody knows. Um, and we've been winning on tool life and price. Um, and it's just going from strength to strength. And it's something I felt I really wanted to talk about with you to, to let people understand a little bit more about it. Sure. So how, how fast do you mention the grades and things? So yeah. I'm presuming when well, I'm doing aluminium, some P, P materials, S materials, mm -hmm. HRSA materials, mm -hmm. you've got something for everything. Yeah, we do. There's two grades, VBX and VTX. Um, if I'm honest, uh, the VBX will cover most people's needs at all times. That's what I tend to go to. It covers everything. Um, and the grades, yeah, as you say, they, they will do anything from plastics all the way up to I've done in canals with some fantastic results. Um, so yeah, uh, chip breakers, if you want a chip breaker for swarf as well, through coolant, no through coolant, it's, it's you know, endless opportunities for the different work that you're trying to do, really. Okay. And looking at these, the first thing I think of is Swiss style, you know, like sliding headlays. But how about if I've got larger machines, maybe index style machines, you know, multi turret? It, it, you know, do these work there? Yeah, I've I've got customers that use them on an array of machines, everything from exactly, as you say, index multi spindle machines, sliding heads, general three axis lathes as well. You know, um, there's 18 different uh, application type inserts. So boring, back boring, face grooving, as it's alluding to. Yeah, face grooving, um, chamfering, a bit of everything, really. So it covers everybody's needs. Um, obviously, the video showcases a few of them as we're having a chat. But um, yeah, we've we've got everything to do most people's work that they would have to have to machine. Sure. And you're at the coal face, you, you know, you're at ASM, you're out selling these products. Mm -hmm. You know, what's your rough conversion rate? If you get given an opportunity against, you know, in the incumbent supplier, you win in half the battles? No, all. This is how good it has been. The, the trials have been really eye opening. I, I genuinely would say that, in my opinion, it is the best product on the market for this type of work. Um, in terms of the tool life we've been able to achieve. I've done some in canal jobs and we are masses ahead of the competition in terms of how long it's lasting. Stainless steel, I did a trial against stainless steel, went from 474 parts with another manufacturer's product to over 2000 with us on some 316 stainless steel on one inset. So massive gains. And what's that down to? Is it the, the rigidity of, of the taper? Is it the coating? Is it the, the, the sub micrograin carbide? Maybe a combination of all? I think the application, it, you know? yeah. Yeah, I, I, I think it is a combination. Um, the insert's got a sort of tapered design. So the back edge of the insert, there's a pin inside the product in the holder itself, which locates it for repeatability. So its repeatability is fantastic, um, which obviously is key in small parts machining. Uh, the finish levels we achieve, you know, I have people that have to chase certain RA finishes and and it's head and shoulders. It's, it's fantastic compared to some of the other products that we've come against for getting those finish levels that they have to achieve. Um, and I think that the nature of some of them, if you've got some difficult to machine applications, we have some with chip breakers and through coolant um, profiling insets if you really want to sort of go down that road. But most of the time, the boring insets are the most popular and they're where we tend to get the lion's share of the, mm -hmm. the sales that we get with it. Just on the sales, they say it's a product... You know, I've seen a few times on my travels, but it's nothing like you threading, let's be honest. So mm. how is this being perceived in the marketplace? Are, are you seeing more and more people come? How are sales in the UK? The the greater that I've sort of been promoting it and winning business, the more the sort of knowledge of it is growing. Uh, and I've been winning business just from people in certain customers that I work with, speaking highly of it to another customer and then contacting me. So it's, it's been a, a really nice process. Uh, so Dan, the final one for me. So if somebody is already using an incumbent system from another supplier, you know, it's going to be, might be a challenge to get them to, to try your tools. How, how's that work with Vargas? 
Yeah, it is often a question that's brought up. Um, you know, you'll visit someone and they will say, oh, you know, I already have this manufacturer in and I have 20 holders. It's very difficult to justify swapping to your system or even starting a trial. But what I'll say is if you, if you let us run the trial, you'll see how good the product really is. And then we will assist you in swap outs, whether that's through free of charge holders to help with the holders you already have. Um, we actually are running a promotion for the whole of 2025. Uh, and if you buy any eight insets of the same shank diameter, you can have a standard holder completely free of charge. So that's a, a way of aiding people. But if it's bigger projects, we'll obviously assist in any way we can to help with those swap outs to win the business. Brilliant. So anyone at home is interested in, in the offer and just find out more about this technology, how do they do so? Um, if you just contact us directly, um, either myself through LinkedIn, if you wish, or through the office, and they'll pass on email addresses to anyone of us that are in your area to support you. 